Hi, I'm Leslie Huffman, Apple Specialist with the Ontario Government. In this video, I'll show you why high-density orchards are the way of the future. Apple growers are planting new orchards for several reasons. To be more profitable, to switch to more profitable cultivars like Honeycrisp and Ambrosia, and to improve fruit quality. High-density orchards are more labor efficient. The potential for mechanization is good with long rows and uniform tree structures. High-density orchards are ideally suited to achieve these goals. But the investment is quite high and some growers struggle with the high costs and the management required. To understand the profitability of orchard investment, it is important to understand the value of small crops in the first five years. This is a key concept. Fruit produced in the early years is much more valuable than fruit produced in later years. If someone offered you $100 now or $100 in one year, which would you take? Of course, you take the $100 now. Similarly, if your orchard produced 100 bushels this year or 100 bushels next year, which would you take? Again, this year's fruit is more valuable. This is a basic concept of economics called net present value or NPV. Think of NPV as the opposite of interest paid. To ensure early cropping and profitability of new orchards, here are four key requirements. First, increasing tree density increases yields in the early years. Each tree carries a few apples, but more trees mean more apples. New orchards are ranging from 1,200 to 2,300 trees per acre. Second, dwarfing rootstocks will increase fruit size and promote early cropping. Dwarf rootstocks change how trees grow. They reduce the size of the tree and grow more fruit buds. Third, tree support encourages the tree to produce more fruit buds and less structural wood. A trellis is more economical than individual tree stakes and reduces twisting in the wind. Install the support when you plant the tree to achieve the maximum benefit. Fourth, good soil moisture and fertility will promote strong tree growth. Trickle irrigation or mulch will work well. Our goal is to reach the top wire as soon as possible and fill the rest of the fruiting area. Each of these requirements, tree density, rootstock, tree support, and irrigation provide a horticultural advantage, and the entire package is needed to achieve the maximum results. Orchard platforms have improved labor efficiency by 20 to 75 percent for pruning, thinning, and tree training. New developments are underway with mechanical hedging to reduce pruning, and future mechanization may include robotics and harvesting systems. Many growers struggle with the high density decision, large investment, existing equipment, available land, high yielding existing orchards, and the cost of trees. Planting the whole package achieves the benefits of high yields, reduced labor costs, and improved fruit quality. The big question remains, are you ready to do density and do it right? Most growers who have planted high-density orchards will never go back.